Hi. Bonkers Hi. Reviews. Uh, How are yeah. you doing? We're here with a special episode today. Oh, yeah. Because not only are we reviewing the McAllister MS CD 18 Li 12, but we are also we're putting it to the test against its the predecessor, a 10 year old McAllister. Yes. Mm. It's all original McAllister, yeah. it's all the original battery. All original. So. Right, right so for fairness, set up the same, same drill bits, everything. Yeah, we're gonna see which drill, 10 years old or brand, or new, brand new, we'll put the screw in your whole pair. So, first of all, 10 year old drill, 10 year old. Lovely. Latest young boy on the block. I'd say that one went in so much quicker. That was a lot smoother. It did struggle about halfway, mm. but it drove it in a lot smoother. Yeah, that was, it was and what about fun. coming out? Oh, oh bit of slipping. Not bad. Let's give it a go, a bit of slip. Takes a bit longer. So this one's quicker. So that one's quicker. This one's a bit slower. Alright, on to the... It's not much difference. No, not for 10 Same years for at 10 all. 10 years, not much difference. Not much difference. On to the next not test, which will be... Who could drill a hole quicker? Mm. <laughs> See in a minute. This one will be put side by side. Next test. The drill bit. Nice. Sweet. No, I struggled. Yeah, I struggled. So, new McAllister does it. Of course, so. um, one thing to note is battery life. Yeah. They were both fully charged. This one's decided to flash itself. But the battery is 10 years old. But, we'll talk about the pros and cons afterwards. Let's, uh, Finish off of the test. Another test is how quickly can you change your bit? Just for fun. So, ready? Three, Three two, two, one, go. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> you swapped it. <laughs> I delayed. I decided Should to put a bit down. I was just going to stop them back. <laughs> All right, three, two, one, go. <laughs> oh, that was a tie. That was just a tie. Might have to Ooh. slow motion that one. <laughs> so, yeah. I right. mean, it's a good drill. They're both 18 volts. I've got one of these myself, else I would have been using mine, but mine's at home. So, I'm using, currently using Stephen's 10 year old McAllister. Which um, does hold up to the job. Yeah, the, the only con. To, for, from this to the, the newer version of the McAllister is battery indicator. Yes, the you new have one doesn't absolutely have absolutely nothing. You've still got the torch, same place. I've got mine on lock. Less gears, but this feels more torquey. This has got 24, that's got 18, but they both kind of work in the same way. They are pretty sure, if I'm correct, aren't they the same sort? No. no different? The only thing that makes me laugh about the new one. But yeah, it comes in a nice carrier case. It, is. it comes in a nice carry case. But of course, everyone that's used to using a power drill is used to a nice big bulky mm. charger. This one's a tiny thing. That's a nice new lightweight charger. Which actually is quite nice. On this charger though, it's, uh, you can press a button for fast charger and that, can't you? Yeah. Uh, fast charge. That one you kind of can't. But what's, obviously you you put the drawers on charge. What's the time rate? Are they did, 45 minutes. Did you put minutes. this one on the same time as yeah. that one? So, so they all fully at the same. So yeah, 45 minutes. That's then. 45 minutes on fast charge or about two hours normal. Yeah. That's about an hour and 50 normal. So they're both nearly enough to say it's just 10 minutes difference. It's currently raining, 
I mean, B and Q have got it on offer. Yeah. Unfortunately, we missed out on the offer. Oh, I know. Because at the minute they've got it where you can buy the unit and two batteries for fifty-five. Pounds. One thing I love about these is I think every other drill company should get in mind is the quick and easy. Oh yeah. It's just Literally that just... simple. Just one button, as whereas on other drills, it's just pinch both sides and pull in it. Yeah. As I've got a Ryobi as well. And and I like the is, ergonomic that is grip. Grip and pull. But I like him. One thing I'm not liking so far is they've gone from metal to plastic chuck. I've noticed different without companies. A lot of companies do that though, too. But they've kept their lower range of repairs as well. Because yes. I've noticed they've gone, because obviously, take off these four screws it pulls out the chuck it pulls out this whole mechanism and it does exactly the same with that one so i like how they've kept with the design yeah for me they've so, gone from a drill that's quite big and aggressive to something that's thin and small but you'll put a lot more screws an hour in yeah this. yeah I prefer that to this. Don't get me wrong, this, obviously 10 years is not done too bad for itself. No. It's been dropped, it's been battered. Left in the rain. Le yeah, left in the rain. And it still works, which is right. quite shocking to be fair. Oh, yeah. see, it's got hammer drill and everything, so it's got all your different stuff. Is that one got hammer drill again? Yes, but it's on. Oh, right, so that's a new. Right. See, this one. Rattle up like, yeah. the years. So you could definitely feel its years, you could definitely hear Stur its years. Sturdiness of the chuck, no this wobble. This one, obviously, the chuck's broke on this one anyway, so you've got to... That's why I've upgraded. Obviously, I'm in hammer drill, so if I take it out of hammer drill, it's still a bit bendy-bendy. Right. So, yes. so any more, f any cons for you? Any pros and cons about this the one to that one? Wait. The weight's quite nice with the newer ones. It's I've noticed on, that. Yeah, so, you can so, use much, it. so much lighter. This one, it does, is quite a bit weighter. But I can't say any more problems. No. So, right, before we both get absolutely drenched, yep. until the next video, stay bonkers. Stay insane. And have fun. See you later. Bye. Bye.